Good morning people, I hope you're having a great day. Um, it's Jack here coming all the way to you from Hakata in Japan. Today's my last day in Japan until I go and get the ferry to Korea tomorrow. Um, it's also the 1st of July, which means it's the first day of the Hakata Gion Festival, which is a big build up for a massive race on the 15th of July but it's a race like no other. There's seven of these big, um, I don't know what you call them, shrines that weigh one ton each and all the men from different regions will carry it and race. But I mean it's a ton but these, these things are magnificent. I've seen a few already and I'm impressed. Um, they're supposed to be seven found around the city Hopefully I can find all seven. Um, and also today, because it's the first day, uh, you, you'll see some of the contestants and the priests will be going around and blessing uh, a lot of these shrines as well. So it's going to be pretty different. Um, I'm, you know, I'm really gutted I'm gonna miss the race actually. They all wear these nappies and they're running around and it's apparently a crazy atmosphere, but at least I can show you the, the shrines. Hey. So I'm just outside the Kushida Shrine and this is where the priest is doing his blessings for one of the, um, the big floats. Uh, there's also loads of, uh, loads of guys here who look like they're going to be in the race on the 15th. Here's another one of the floats in the shopping centre. Look at this. miss this one because it's tucked away but I'm glad I spotted it One thing I forgot to say about the um, 
Gion Hakata Festival is it's been going on for such a long time. I'm talking back in the Edo period, which is like samurai days. So, hence why it's so traditional and uh, kind of different, I guess. my fun so I'm gonna make my way back to the city at Hakata get some, maybe get some more food or something almost back at the hostel now I need to do some video editing and then I'll be back out at night time so I'll see you then. So it's almost time for me to say goodbye to Japan now. Last day. It's getting quite emotional actually. I am going to go get some ramen. What a result. I've actually managed to find the last float. Where are you? Over here. <laughs> I'm genuinely so happy I found the last one. I spent the whole day thinking I'd only found six out of the seven and then finally when I'd given up, there it was. <laughs> Almost at my favourite ramen place now. This is the place. Finish your fun ramen. So I'm going to end the vlog right here guys, last day in Japan, can't believe it. Um, I'll see you tomorrow when I get the boat over to Korea, peace. <laughs>